So now let's start to discuss about saturated tables. So these saturated tables, it can be saturated water, it can be saturated refrigerant. These tables are used when we are dealing with saturated liquids, saturated vapor or mixtures of that. Saturated liquids and saturated vapors are straightforward. You just directly read from the table. On the table, you are given V, G and V, F values. So G refers to vapor state and uh, F refers to liquid state. But what about in between? What about mixtures? So that is the difficult part when it comes to reading this table. Uh, let's focus on that. Mixtures have two components, saturated liquid component and saturated vapor component. Each phase can be considered separately for uh, our calculation purposes. In this diagram, we have shown this mixture have saturated vapor component and saturated liquid component. So saturated vapor component have the properties of saturated vapor and saturated liquid component have properties of saturated liquid. If you have a saturated mixture, let's say in a piston cylinder device, most of the time you are going to see these two phases saturated liquid and saturated vapor separately but we are concerned about the entire mass so we can consider uh, saturated mixture as a single phase when we are calculating properties of this mixture important thing is to know what is the amount of vapor and what is the amount of liquid there therefore we define a property called quality Quality is the mass of vapor divided by total mass of the mixture. Total mass of the mixture is equal to mass of saturated liquid plus mass of saturated vapor. If I want to calculate the average specific volume, I can calculate it using this equation. It is equal to Vf plus quality into Vfg. Vfg is the difference of Vg and Vf. If you are given specific volumes, you can calculate the quality using this equation. These two equations are not limited for specific volume. You can calculate enthalpy, entropy or internal energy using these equations. So here I have given all three of these equations. This is a clipping from UR equation sheet. You can see that the equation given is only for specific volume but you can use the same equation for all other properties also it is easy to remember this equation using vector notation uh, shown here 